If the National Conference of the Irish Pharmacy Union uh, decided at the weekend that possession of small illegal drug amounts for personal use should be seen as a health rather than a criminal issue. Uh, we're joined by the President of the Irish Pharmacy Union, Dara Connolly. Good morning. Good morning, Carl. Can you tell us exactly what this change in policy that you're re- recommending would cover and why you're recommending it? What we're recommending is that we should be treating people who have problem drug usage as patients who need help, who need a pharmacist's help, who need a healthcare solution, rather than people who need to be firstly going into the criminal justice system and being labelled for the rest of their life as people with, uh, with issues around societal issues. Every day, pharmacists in Ireland are helping people who have problems with drugs and helping them to get the best out of the solutions for that. We want to be able to treat all our patients equally. And what we can see is where... Good policy has been put into effect in Europe where countries have decided that possession of small amounts of illicit drugs doesn't automatically result in a criminal charge. It may result in a criminal charge, but it's not automatic. The first solution should be a healthcare one to get that person back on track. And what would you say to those people listening to this morning who would feel this would, if adopted, would send out the wrong signal that... Uh, drug use is okay and the state shouldn't send out a signal of that kind? Uh, The Irish Pharmacy Union is also sending out a message to say that drug use and problem drug use is wrong. What we need to look at though, Cahill, is what are we doing now to make things better and what is working? When the Health Research Board put out their statistics for drug deaths in Ireland between 2004 and 2014, Nearly 7,000 people have died in Ireland in that 11-year time period because of problem drug usage. That's the entire population of the town of Dungarvan, where I am from. The amount of people dying in Ireland from problem drug usage is three times as many as it is people who die on the road. We have had really, really good healthcare outcomes when we've looked at alternative ways of doing things. Take the smoking ban, for instance. And it's not beyond us here in Ireland to work together as healthcare professionals to be able to put good policy together to say there's a better way of doing things and we can help people. The wider societal issues, the knock-on effects of the criminalisation of people who use small amounts of illicit drugs makes it harder for them to access good health care D- and pharmacists want to be able to help. Dara Connolly, I'm going to have to stop you there because we're right out of time. Obviously, you're raising an issue which we will be coming back to again. Dara Connolly of the Irish Pharmacy 